gonna cover LTCN today. We haven't covered this trust in a while. Our thesis was that we wanted to see if the huge returns that LTCN did in the previous bull run are going to repeat themselves. So far, we have seen quite a lot of volatility. We needed to expect that. So we had a nice push in price before the beginning of the year, up to the first week of January. Then we corrected hard from $19 to eight something, 850. And then we had the huge massive pump from eight to a top of 54, but we didn't stabilize in price and we corrected hard first to $19 and then back down to 10. So the trade is still live because we have not seen the exponential phase of Bitcoin. That's going to pull all grayscale trusts, including LTCN. But the most important thing is to see the structure of the chart. So we have higher lows since September of 2023 and even June of 2023, which means that once we correct, each base gets higher, higher in price. So we went from a base of $3 to a base of $8.30 and now a base of $10. You have to live with the volatility. Either you trade each movement, which is very tricky to predict, or you accumulate shares throughout the bear market and then you wait until the end of the bull run and you see what you end up with. That is the most common and easiest way to proceed. That's my thesis. I have a few shares of each trust including LTCN, and I'm evaluating their performance up to mid to three quarters of 2025. We will see where we will get at that stage. I'm not daily trading or weekly trading these trusts. I buy, hold, and see if my thesis will pan out, pretty much. And I assume that I'm going to lose my money <laughs> because... I don't really know what's going to happen. But like I indicated, we have higher lows and we corrected from 54 to 10. We have a solid base here now at $10. And you, you see that we just broke this downwards movement on the trend line in the last two days. That's the last two candles. And that coincides with the rate cuts announced by the Fed that pump all risky assets. So stocks, Bitcoin, crypto in general, and also the associated trusts like LTCN, they both, they all pump because they are risky assets. So do we expect more cuts in the future? Yes, if that's so, it brings a lot of bullishness and a lot of push for risky assets. So in this case, for the thesis, would have been a good idea to accumulate in the bear market and wait for these pulls each time to accumulate more shares, especially if they were higher lows and that has been the case for Grayscale at different times since the beginning of 2024. So for those who want to test this trade, it's still a good entry because we are near the bottom. Obviously it's not $3 anymore, but it's 10. So you lose that 3X there, but we came from $50 down to $10. So that's an important correction. Now we need you know, the price to be above the MA50 and eventually have a golden cross and cross the ME200. The trade is still alive. We could see 
way higher volumes and way higher price action for LTC and still in the future the potential is there let's look at the potential on the weekly chart so you see it here the potential for LTCN would be starting at 320 360 400 430 or higher so from 15 to these levels it's quite a lot of excess and that's what I'm basing on my thesis of are we going to get the same results as the previous bull run? This was the previous bull run. You see that the ME50 on the weekly chart is slightly trading upwards, but the ME200 still has downwards movement. So we're gonna need a big push to 40, then challenge the ME200 and a breakout to 80 once we are at I would say clearly, yeah, at $60, it would be a very, very bullish sign. And then it's going to be increments of $10 from 80 to 90 to 100 and so forth. We will see how high we will go. So the trade is still on for LTCN. Have a look at it, look into it, but it's extremely risky, not financial advice. I did not expect to have that much volatility, but that's crypto and that's the associated trust associated with crypto. This one is associated with a Litecoin. For now, in September of 2024, the trade is alive and you still have an opportunity to test the thesis. Are we going from $15 up to $500? or from $15 up to even higher, $750, $1,000, who knows? My thesis is to put a small bag on a few of these trusts and see if we can recover a lot of gains from here up to September of 2025. Let's see.